federal lawmakers are on a spending legislation spree this week, and here is a look at three funding bills they're considering. Three high-profile spending bills are moving through Congress this week. They'd provide funding to help Ukraine to address the baby formula shortage and to support small businesses still recovering from the pandemic. The Senate is expected to pass a Ukraine aid package on Thursday. Strong bipartisan support for this funding in the House and in the Senate, but also insurance that we have effective oversight of our assistance to Ukraine. That bipartisan support might be harder to find for two other funding bills Congress is considering. Now these same big spenders are proposing another $50 billion next week to bail out restaurants. Restaurants that have been primarily injured by overzealous Democrat governors and their edicts. Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer is fast-tracking a bill to help restaurants, bars, and other businesses still struggling due to the pandemic. It's unlikely to get the 60 votes needed to pass. Some Republicans support it, but Democratic Senator Joe Manchin says he probably won't. Over in the House... Mothers across the country are looking to us for help. And we will not force them to face this crisis on their own. Democrats want $28 million to try to ease the baby formula shortage. Most of it would pay for more FDA workers and to inspect production facilities. Republican Senator John Cornyn has said that he thinks focusing on the supply chain would be more effective. And we will keep you posted on all of these bills, of course, on air and online at clickondetroit.com.